is a new SPAC in town, guys. So CFII. So let's look at this chart right here. It's still right around $10. It's at $10.50 per share right now. Of course, I was super excited this morning and I bought it $10.90 per share. But with the, in this case, I wanna put my money where my mouth is. I think this SPAC is gonna blow up once it gets on people's radar. I sent you guys a message this morning uh, right on my feed. A few of you responded to it. Um, and I wanna be able to do that kind of thing in the morning um, when I can't make a quick video. Uh, because in this case, I think this is gonna really blow up when people figure out what they do. So stick around, we're gonna talk about it. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for joining me for another video. I'm Richard Allen. We talk about stocks on this channel and a lot of the stocks we talk about on this channel are way, way up. And this company, I think will be no exception. So let's talk about it. So today we're gonna to talk about CFII. It's a SPAC that's, uh, that's merging with a company called VIEW. And this is a really exciting tech. We're gonna watch a couple videos. So the first video we're gonna watch talks about what the technology is, what they do, and it gives a great representation of the potential future of the company. And then uh, we'll watch um, one other video as well that I think uh, even says more about what the company does. So let's just, uh, let's just jump right into this video here. All too often, the human experience within a building is an afterthought, as most windows let light in without controlling heat and glare. So beautiful buildings are redecorated from the inside out with blinds to block the sun. There is a better way. View Smart Glass brings the outside in, intelligently controlling natural light without blinds or shades, enhancing mental and physical well-being. It's regular glass with a series of thin nano coatings that react to a small electrical charge, creating different levels of tint. View Smart Glass is part of an intelligent, predictive system that looks at a building holistically using artificial intelligence and machine learning algorithms. View Intelligence takes the building's orientation, surrounding obstructions, and the arc of the sun to seamlessly optimize the amount of natural light available throughout the day. We factor in seating arrangements and the distance of people to the windows, integrating seamlessly with lighting and cooling systems to maximize comfort and efficiency. We also keep an eye on your local weather. All this data helps create the world's most intelligent windows. Smart windows, huh? Pretty cool. Like, Not only does this technology can it can save a company money because it doesn't let as much heat in and out and vice versa right so heating bills and air conditioning bills can be cheaper but also it increases the product productivity of the staff if you've ever worked in an office building or in a retail setting at all and you're fighting with the sun and it's causing headaches and you're putting blinds up and down and i used to work in a jewelry store it was this jewelry store that used to be an old bank so it had these crazy like floor to ceiling windows that just looked amazing but when the sun was beaming through them, we had to mess with shades. And it was like, if we had this technology that just did it for us, think of it would increase the productivity of us. It would, it would make us so we're like, we're still, we feel like we're outside. It's more comfortable. So that's the kind of thing that view is doing. So also another big thing that they're doing, they can turn this glass into something else. So let's watch this. Hello. I'm Rao Mulpuri, and along with my colleagues, over the last 12 years, we've been building VIEW to transform the day-to-day -day window. The smart window controls heat and glare, eliminates blinds and shades, and provides view and natural light all the time. Because we have a highly connected system, we're able to bring a whole host of smart building applications. For example, this video you're watching is coming to you through the VIEW smart display, which is a high-definition display that's installed right Look at that! Look at that, how cool is that? That's like the friggin' future. We see that we see this kind of stuff in sci-fi movies all the time. And I know we're starting to have like smart mirrors and smart glass like on our like on our refrigerators and different appliances and things like this. Uh, but in an office setting, like how cool is it? You can just pull up something on your right on your window and start doing a presentation. Like this is super, super exciting tech. To the window. Also on this platform, we have a sensor array that has a number of environmental sensors. And these can be used in order to control the environment precisely for the health and wellness of the people. These new applications transform buildings into living spaces that help us engage, interact, and communicate with each other. 
the buildings will be transformed into high-speed 5G cell towers with complete wireless coverage. Now that the blinds are lifted, these humanized spaces will keep us entertained while keeping us connected to natural light and views of the outdoors. And we're just getting started. <laughs> People are just going to be watching Netflix now, <laughs> like on their glass, right? Like, <laughs> hey, you watching Netflix again? Turn, turn that Tiger King off. Turn it off. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I'm, I'm really, really excited about this deck. I think it's, I think it's the future. Um, they're, uh, I, I still have to do a bunch of research to figure out who their competitors are, but it sounds like they're way ahead of the curve. They're ready for mass production. They have like a thousand different patents already. Uh, the, the, the tech is like really, really, really cool. Um, and it's, I think like this is going to be the freaking future. So the one thing I want to talk about quick though, is this is a long-term hold for me. This is a long-term hold for me and I'll show you why. Look at all the different companies they're working with. Netflix, FedEx, CenturyLink, Google, HP, Uber, Regeneron. Everybody knows about Regeneron now because of these vaccines and therapeutics and stuff. Bunch of different colleges and universities, bunch of different hospitals, airports, whole bunch of different airports, and then different real estate providers too. This is probably where the majority of their marketing and sales force will go because the real estate companies that run these office buildings will be the one making these decisions in the long term, okay? The reason it's a, a, a very long term hold for me, um, and I'm sorry I'm scrolling through this presentation super fast, but I want to talk about revenue, okay? The revenue right now is not fantastic. They're expected to uh, do about $37 million in revenue this year. 31, there we go. So $31 million in revenue this year, but the expectation is they will grow by over 100% year over year for at least the next five years. Now the, the total addressable market for this is absolutely crazy. So be, if, if they have 1.9, almost $1.9 billion in sale by 2025, it's still less than 1% of the total market. The, the, the total addressable market for this is absolutely massive. Like every single building could use this glass. Every single building. So think, think about where this could possibly go. It, it could go crazy, right? So the fact that this is still trading around $10 right now, is great. That means we're in on the ground floor. This merger was just announced yesterday after hours. So I wanted to get this out to you as quick as possible. I don't see anybody else reporting on this. So remember, I'm the first person that brought this to you. Okay. Um, but let me know how excited you are about this tech. I'm very excited about this tech. As always, if you didn't already do it, click that beautiful red subscribe button down below and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks.